what is up everybody good morning how y'all doing hope everybody doing well so we are at our bando school situation this park right here got the school west jacksonville back though i've been doing a three pack a day not in a posting assist but i've been doing three packs every morning um i just gotta get more better with posting the, um, the footage uh, but I want to get a little practice session in, and I specifically want to work on like inverted stalls, inverted yaw spins. I've been working on them, and I got them almost crisp in the sim. And um, and we want to work on them out here, see what we can do with the with the quad, cause they've been looking pretty juicy. All right, here we go. We are recording. It is pack number two. Why is that button up? Okay. Take off nice and easy. These pots got a lot of thrust. Art. All right. Uh, that's seeing more controllable. They're kind of floaty too, but it's this better. I had the motor output limit. Um, I didn't change it, and that's what I was feeling. I didn't change it back anyways. Cause I put a motor output limit on here cause I'm not running no GoPro and I'm not, uh, I'm not running no GoPro. And, and I used to fly the 1700 KV. So yeah, the motor output limit, um, I guess it's better than the throttle limit. All right, we're recording once again on stick cam, okay. It's taking off on a picnic table or whatever. Okay, I had to overdub this because my audio had messed up uh, when I was flying. Um, yeah, so taking off, that y'all spin was pretty sweet. Um, I'm getting, a, I'm feeling more comfortable with the y'all spins most definitely. And and doing them um, consistent and coming out of the y'all spin like smoothly. Right here, I think I was working with vanity rolls. Yeah, I was working with vanity rolls, but not just that. This is uh, why I was upset about it because I was explaining this while I was flying. But it's this move like right there when I try to change direction and you come to a stop and then change and go back smoothly. And I just been trying to work on getting that consistently. I can do it sometimes really, really good if I'm just not even thinking about it. But you know, that was a thing. Yeah, I was talking about this playground. This playground just look horrible. It's terrible. Oh yeah, yeah, um, yeah. It was a fire. That's what happened. Bad behind kids. Uh, set the school on fire right now. That um. That's West Jacks Elementary. Yeah, they, um, they, it was a fire, then they closed down the school. Yeah, my, uh, my little sister actually went to this school. This West Jacks Elementary right here. Yeah. Most definitely. They was talking about, um, I think they trying to fight it, but they trying to tear this whole, uh, parking, um, school down. Or somebody council people talking about that they trying to fight it. Okay, that was a really nice juicy. Oh yeah, I remember this. Oh oh I tried to hold it. I tried to hold it and go for it. 
But I did not want to get stuck in that tree. No, not at all. But I tried to hold it and go for it. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting my power loops better, like a little tighter. Uh, even just then right there, get comfortable with being upside down. That's a big thing right there. Oh yeah, I'm wilder right there. I don't know what. I think I was low on battery. But that is a big thing. Uh, getting comfortable being upside down. Uh, I didn't. I I didn't uh, realize the importance of that. Um, so I started back flying. When you uh, fly, but when you start to fly, you just want to, you know, fly and rip around and stuff. And I understand the importance of uh, certain maneuvers you want to do, start doing quickly as possible, just to improve your know, overall what you can and can't do. Because going upside down, even with a quad, it's just uh, it's disorienting and. Uh, you know, you gotta get used to it. Most definitely, you definitely gotta get used to it. If somebody was to ask me what to work on first, I would definitely tell them to work on going upside down, get comfortable being completely inverted and hanging out, watching the ground rush up to you. You know, I think that'll make you a better pilot off the rip. Oh yeah, right here, I'm running out of the battery. I'm trying to get back before I kill it. All right, we are recording once again. I got a charger hooked up to my phone right now because whew, it's dying. Hopefully I can get a stick cam review. I think last pack went pretty decent. Um, but I don't think I got the whole stick cam. So I apologize for that. Um, we are armed. This is pack number three. We are armed. I'm starting that foolishness already. Uh, don't crash first taking off. Yeah, last pack I think went pretty good from a practice standpoint, not from a like flight edit standpoint, but. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's one that if you if you rate the downsides about the 3 that is one downside right there is if you crash it don't get the crashes because you disarm as soon as you disarm if you um i'm not sure if you if you manually record does it do the same thing but once you disarm it stops recording so so you're not gonna get your crashes and uh that's pretty sketchy too fast. I don't know what the hell going on with this pack. Alright. Oh, that was a good one. Yeah, I've been I've been working on those in this area. This sim really been helping. Like, when I used to fly before I took my break, I never used to use the sim. Because I was using liftoff um, when I first learned acro, and then after I first started flying a quad, liftoff flew nothing like a real quad. So I thought I would really mess myself up by going back and forth, but Velocidrome feels very, very similar. At least for like learning tricks, the stick feel of learning tricks. The rates feel like a little bit different to me, like what from, from like. Uh, I didn't get that from Velocidrome. I gotta work on my power loops. Yeah, it's windy. I thought that was the, uh, man, it said low battery and then it took a hole like that right there and I thought that was, um, GPS return to home or something. It was the wind. I'm like, yeah, no, 
This bitch not returning home, is it? Oh, sketched. Oh, I'm getting them bitches almost every time. I, oh my, I was giving them the language, but almost every time. That's dope. What am I doing with that power loop right though? Is it because it's a wire? Am I just scared of that power loop like that? I don't think I'm gonna try no trippy because because I definitely gonna crash. I still ain't got a trippy down in the simulator. I'm talking about doing it on here, jeez. Yeah, not today. Yeah, not today. Try to somewhat keep these pots buttery. They flying pretty good right now. Oh yeah, they, they flying pretty good. Damn, I was trying to see if it was a gap for me to hit on the way down. That would have been dope. This car definitely faster. Ooh. I started watering. It's a pretty productive pack. Hopefully I got everything in shot. <laughs>